Phantom Sabi, welcome back to the channel. We've got a battle on Pearl River, we've got Hyphen from Fitty Clan. It's in the Cobra, the tier 9 uh, battle pass token tank. I think it still costs around about 24 tokens, but um, anyway. It's a, it's a four shot auto loader. It's got a pretty powerful gun, but a really long load time as you can see. So you're going to pick your time. Good penetration on the high explosive round, 490 damage and 210 pen. That's what he's loading to start with. And 268 for this heat round. Which does a bit less damage, the 360 so he's after the good damage. 210. It's pretty useful against tier 8s. And what have we got here? Alright, and there you go. Got a bit of frontal armor there, just angled nicely to bounce that one. Probably go through the T44 if he stays in place. But he's just held a shot there. Maybe too many targets in front. And now he's moving up. I think he's going to go up the hill. Might take a shot as he goes up. So he does. So he tries to cut the corner and stay out. And he's got a SU 130PM. Now he's avoiding him. Now he's going to light him up. He's got the Load. So look at the rate of fire though, that's the important part of this one. Two kills in quick succession. Batch at 12T and the SU-130PM. So that's giving him 1400 damage in pretty quick succession. So that's the bonus that you get. The penalty of course is long reload. Alright, so now they've pretty much claimed the centre. Gives you a few vantage points and he'll try and shoot down on the tanks that are Coming up the line there. It's got a Martian, and it will be fine at this position, as long as um, no one can spot him from the other side. And this, he'll probably get a reasonable number of side shots. Alright, in fact, there you go. This here, 5-2K. Just manages to shoot him. He'll probably get another shot in, which he does. And another kill. Get one more shot, and unfortunately that does very little damage there, but nonetheless, that's given him 2.7k, and we are about three and a half minutes into the game, so decent rate of fire in that respect, and three kills as a result. So now, as with all autoloaders, it's a bit of a waiting game while you're reloading, and that's, it's got some nice protection here. Now it's coming up the hill against him, so he can basically pick his shooting time. Alright, the team has managed to keep those tanks in pretty much the same position, which is good for Hyphen. Can he get some side shots? Yes, he can. There's the target too. They shot him. One shot in. Should get the kill, which he does. that mountain to back up. It's got two nice shots so you can get into him. Can he just come a little bit further forward? Oh, he bounces around from the T44. That one just didn't hit. It's got a wait for the aim time. He does get the second, the last one in the T44 there below. And I think Hyphen thinking, all right, we've got to get that T44. But uh, this has turned into a bit of a ruffle stomp, partly with Hyphen's effort. <laughs> haven't lost a single tank, the enemy have lost 10, so it's really just a bit of a uh, scrap now for the remaining hit points. And Hyphen just waiting for that reload, he wants to punish that T44 and the Mousham. But uh, will they last long enough while his team are surrounding them? So he comes out here. This T44, can he get a shot into him? No, he's just about disappeared and I think he's just died now. Here comes the Martian. So just aim a bit more carefully. Just see the blue gets from the, the uh, movement there. Gets the kill on the Martian. 4.3k of damage. There's not many enemies left. There's only a Patton and a Borsig. As I talk, <laughs> they took out a Waffle Dragon. There's the pattern. Oh, we might be able to get a shot in here. Aim, 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 aim. He just got bumped by the LH MTB. Did get a shot of damage in there. Unfortunately, he doesn't get the kill. Uh, it's just the Borsig left. Don't think it's likely that he's going to get any more damage out of this. But 
got uh, just under 4.8k of damage and we are literally just ticking over 5 minutes of the game. And can he get a shot in? No. Lost sight of the uh, Warsig. No, he's gone around the corner behind the rocks and he, he's gone dark. So unless he comes out, which I think is unlikely, I don't think High will get any more damage out of this one. He really has disappeared. Oh no, there he goes. But uh, no, not giving a target to Hyphen, unfortunately. That Warsig won't last any much longer. And there he goes, and that's the end of the game. So, yeah, five and a half minutes. And he's got nearly 4.8k damage. Let's go and look at the details. Alright, rapid fire game. Five kills, 4.8k of damage. Uh, he managed to block just over a k of damage, that always helps. Uh, he's earned a high caliber ward for the most damage, and Brothers in Arms. Uh, he was platooning with Gramps, so he's gone back to 1AR. Uh, Turned him the first class mastery badge. So well, let's have a look how close he got to an ace tank. Uh, let's have a look. Team score. Here we go. All right. So finished on top of experience 1221. So just missed out on the ace tanker. I'd have to check the level for the cobra. Um, but uh, that was a pretty good game there. Now, a lot of gaps there, of course, but um, using the tank well. Uh, Gramps came in pretty close there with three cave damage use not to be sneezed at, and in fact that was the second highest damage for the game. And on the enemy side, the Tiger 2 that managed to get a hit into him <laughs> actually came in top of experience, but the, as you saw, was a roll to stomp and very low damage across most of the uh, tanks playing there. All right, so what does it cost to run the Cobra? So he's fired 14 shots and I'm pretty much premium all the way, I'm pretty sure. 13 hits though, they're great shooting, 12 penetrations. Just that unlucky ricochet off the T44, he would have got another pen, which would have ticked him over to 5k for sure. So not a huge amount of income, but was benefiting from personal reserves running as well as battle payments. And so he's made a total of 57k, which is pretty nice at tier 9, um, not to be sneezed at, at all. So nice game there from Hyphen, thanks very much for supplying the replay. I hope you'd enjoyed this or get something to learn about the Cobra. Um, doesn't feature in too many videos, so I don't, I'm not really sure why. But uh, if you got something out of it, please give the video a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, that's an option for you. Like more content, follow. Thanks very much for watching.